Hi, I'm Dr. Lee Fang Jan from Eurodoc. Today I'll be sharing with you the various treatments for benign prostatic hypertrophy. Benign prostatic hypertrophy or prostate enlargement is a normal part of the aging process in men. This can cause bothersome urinary symptoms and may lead to complications with time. Fortunately, there are many ways that this can be treated. A prostate is a walnut-sized gland that sits below the bladder and surrounds the urethra, the tube that you pass urine from. The prostate makes ejaculatory fluid, the milky white fluid that makes up most of the ejaculate and provides nourishment for the sperm. The prostate is very responsive to testosterone, the male hormone made in the testis. Testosterone stimulates the prostate gland to grow. As men usually don't stop making testosterone throughout their life, their prostate may continue to grow in size as they get older. The next treatment option involves inserting a catheter into the urethra and use focused microwave heating to destroy the prostate tissue, together with a pressurized balloon to push apart the prostate tissue. This creates a wider passage in the prostate for urine to flow through the treatment takes 45 minutes and can be performed under local anesthesia. This procedure involves passing small camera into the urethra and putting small permanent implants into the prostate. These implants will lift and hold the obstructing prostate tissue apart, increasing the width of the urethra passage. This reduces the obstruction to the urinary flow, improves the speed of the flow and reduces BPH symptoms. This procedure is performed under local anesthetic or sedation as a day surgery procedure and typically takes 5 to 10 minutes. Symptoms resolve soon after the surgery and patient typically returns to normal activity by the next day. Water vapor therapy works by injecting sterile water vapor or steam through the cystoscope into the prostate gland during a series of 9 seconds treatment. When the steam is injected into the prostate tissue, all the stored energy is released into the tissue and over time, the body reabsorbs the treated tissue, shrinking the prostate. With the extra tissue removed, the urethra opens up and reduces BPH symptoms. This procedure is performed under local anesthetic as a day surgery procedure and typically takes only 5 to 10 minutes. After the procedure, a urethra catheter is usually necessary and is inserted for 5 to 14 days. All three minimally invasive surgical techniques can effectively relieve BPH symptoms while preserving sexual functions. Most men see improvement in their symptoms within a few weeks and can return to regular activities within a few days after the treatment. However, there are selection criteria for these treatments. The choice needs to be individualized and carefully selected by the treating urologist based on the size and configuration of the patient's prostate. Not all prostates can be treated by minimally invasive surgery techniques. Very large prostates or men who have complications from BPH such as urinary retention, bladder stones or blocked kidneys may need surgery that can relieve large amounts of prostate tissue. You can book an appointment with us through the Eurodoc website to consult us or do visit us in our clinic.